As winter winds down, immersing yourself in some humid and earthy air sounds pretty good, doesn't it? For decades, the Mitchell Park Dome's Tropical Dome has been just the ticket for winter-weary visitors. And now, as Ellie Nakamoto White discovered, there's a way to experience the sense of this Milwaukee landmark in your own home. Fabulous. There's really nothing like it. It's so unique. They're one of a kind. Since the 1960s, they do look very science fiction type. The Milwaukee domes have towered over the city, standing tall at 85 feet high. So Donald Grebe, the architect, had patented this design. So it is the only conoidal shaped conservatory in the world. The Living Museum features thousands of plant species, animals, and water features and it's inside the Tropical Dome. In this dome here, we have an award-winning orchid grower. That brings a rainforest to the good land. What they love about it is that earthy smell, and so they walk in here and it just hits you. For Krista Biel Diefenbach, the executive director for Friends of the Domes. It is beautiful, it's a tourist destination, but it's also a place where we can come and heal and we can connect with nature. But all of that requires upkeep, and all of that costs a lot of cash. The domes, they are in danger. So with one door potentially closing, We've thought about the candle for quite some time. A new one is now open. Milwaukee Candle Company is a local handmade candle company and we focus on scent memory connection. Which is why manager Wes Mars and the rest of the team have spent years developing their hometown collection. It was about Milwaukee and about highlighting the amazing places and events that the city has to offer. Which sparked their latest idea. How do you create the sound of a bird in a scent? How do you see all of these like little triangles of glass and all of this like sunlight coming in? How do you convert that into a scent? Meet the newest hometown edition. The Tropical Dome candle is obviously inspired by the Tropical Dome. It took nearly 15 tries to get the scent just right. We were able to curate a scent that really hits on like that really fresh ozonic air, wet, damp earth, woody notes, and then kind of highlighting some of the things that grow in the space. And after each jar is filled, it takes hours to cool before being stamped and ready to go. All right, those look good. For each six ounce candle sold, one dollar will be donated to the domes. And for their 12 and a half ounce candles, they'll raise it to two. And as long as the city shows love. They are beautiful and really a point of pride for our community. Both legacies will continue to grow. These sort of grassroots efforts are what's gonna make a difference with keeping the domes around and making sure that they're here in the city for ages to come.